Welcome to Vascular Associates. My name is Bud Schuler, and I am the founder of this team of professionals here in Panama City, focused on making a difference in your life. Today, you're being seen for a common problem that's usually overlooked in healthcare. It's a problem within the veins of your legs. Now, these veins are structures that carry the blood back to the heart. Venous disease can manifest itself in many different ways, and thus, it's often missed because the symptoms of failing veins are misinterpreted as symptoms of old age. Failing veins present as a broad spectrum from simple spider veins to bulging ropey varicose veins with brown discoloration of your legs and ulcers. But most people, they only notice an achy, heavy, tired, swollen, restless, numb, or tingly legs. Presentation can be varied, but most of the symptoms become worse as the day goes on. Backwards flow or reflux in the veins is what causes these symptoms. And as you're aware, the heart beats and pumps the blood to the feet. But how does that blood get back to the heart? Well, the veins in the legs are under low pressure and they need a pump to help pump the blood back through the veins and get it back to the heart so that it can go back through circulation. Well, that's where the calf muscles come in. The calf muscles act as a pump as well, pumping the blood back against gravity so that it can get back to the heart to be recirculated. Well, the veins have these little valves inside because they're not as strong as arteries. And unless you're standing on your head with gravity pulling downward, gravity's always pulling the blood towards your feet in the opposite direction that the veins are trying to pump the blood. Your legs being sedentary from either standing or sitting for prolonged periods of time, the blood tends to pool in the calves by that gravitational force. And this is what leads to your legs feeling tired, achy, and heavy or swollen at the end of the day. So, lack of activity increases a chance that you're going to have vein problems. These little valves in the veins help keep the blood flowing in one direction. And as the veins themselves start to dilate up, the valves get farther and farther apart so that they ultimately do not work like they're supposed to. And the blood gets pulled down into your feet, again, causing pooling. That pressure leads to the symptoms of the tiredness, achiness and heaviness, or restless legs. It can lead to the brown discoloration around your ankles. And that leakage of the blood leads to inflammation that can cause thickened skin, ulceration and weeping. So in addition that the blood pools in your calves and the leg veins, that blood that sits there can ultimately clot and become a life-threatening issue. The common risk factors are not just a sedentary lifestyle of standing or sitting for long periods of time, but teachers, nurses, clerks, cashiers, beauticians, barbers, truck drivers, anybody that sits or stands for a long period of time has an increased risk. Have questions? We're here to help. Call today to schedule an appointment at 215-VEIN or visit us online at arteryandveins.com to learn more.